Hi, I'm Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're making coconut macaroons. I've never made them before, so this is my first time. Um, I'm doubling the recipe, but the original recipe is two egg whites, a third cup of sugar, and two and a quarter cups of shredded coconut. And in with this, we're just going to add, oh, if I can get it open, uh, half a teaspoon of almond extract. Um, half a teaspoon of vanilla. And then you just whisk that together until it's all, I don't know, fluffy, I'm guessing. Bye. 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 Where are you going? Right, we'll come back once that's all this. Like, I've been whisking that for a good five minutes or so. So now we're just going to fold in the coconut bit by bit. As I always forget, the oven needs to be preheated on a preheated on 170, which I've got going. And these bake in the oven for about 20 minutes until the coconut starts turning a little bit toasty. I'm gonna decorate mine with a cherry on top. Right, I'm assuming that's done. It's only problem when you're making a recipe you've never done before. You're not sh quite sure how it's supposed to go. Right, we're going to go with that. So I've got my tray and my parchment paper, my scoop. Right, you're just going to keep going until they're all done. Get my toes. Just to show you. Quite huge. Right. And they're going to go in the oven for 20 minutes and we'll see what they look like once they come out. gotta say i'm quite impressed with how these turned out they took 25 minutes to cook because i felt they were just some of them were a little bit soft but i'm gonna just try one just see what they're like mm. they're really nice oh yeah that's an extra to this video just to use up the egg yolks so we're not wasting them i've got 180 grams of butter, half a cup of brown sugar, and a third cup of white sugar. And we're just going to mix those till they're combined. We're going to make chocolate chip egg yolk cookies. So rather than wasting the egg yolks, because I would have just binned them if I'm honest, I thought I'd try and do this. So we'll see how these turn out. Right, once you've got that. Add in two large egg yolks, mine are only small, so I'm just putting four in there just to use them up. And then we want a teaspoon of vanilla. And an eighth teaspoon of salt. That's that's well combined. Right, we're going to add a teaspoon of baking powder. And then add in 
one cup of flour. All right, and then just mix this till it's well combined. Without trying to make too much mess. I'm making these smart, he loves cookies. So I'm sure he'll be happy to give a taste test once they're done. Yeah, honey. I hate doing this by hand, but my hand mixer has uh, just decided to break. So, God. good work out if anything. Right, once you're happy with that. We're going to add in two third cups of chocolate chips of your choice. These are what I've got, so these are what I'm using. I'm half tempted to chuck the rest of those cherries in there just so they don't go to waste. Yeah, let's do it. Never have too much in a cookie. So I'm just going to grab the rest of the cherries. There's a lot of money in there, but rather than just chopping them, because it's not really good for anything else, just chop them up into quarters. I love cherries, but I don't because they're just so sticky. These are going to go in the oven at 175 oh, for about 10 to 15 minutes, but I will keep an eye on them. And the coconut macaroons are nearly done. Get those out the oven in a minute. I've added another uh, third cup of flour because I just felt the mixture was a bit too wet. I mean, it's still quite wet now, but it was really wet. And then we're just going to scoop it onto a tray. Make sure you leave plenty of space for. I'm assuming these are going to expand. put them in the oven 10 15 minutes just keep an eye on them and i'll show you what these look like once they're done but over here we've just taken out the macaroons and i've got so many look and smell amazing but um we'll wait for them to cool down and see how they all set and stuff right let's put these in the oven and i'll show you what they look like once they're done Right, they're in the oven for about 15, 20 minutes. They've come out absolutely gorgeous. I went to try a bite, and then that's all that's left out of the one cookie. They're really soft on the inside, but they've got a nice crunch on the outside. Um, Mark's going to do a taste test quickly for you. Oh, wow. They're really nice. Because we were just throwing them together. They're actually really nice, aren't they? Mm. That's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe. Bye.